Welcome back to another episode of Transport Fever 2 with Casualty Gaming, where we left off in the last episode, we were working on setting up this second rail line that was going to pick up oil from the Inglewood oil well, transport it up to this Lowell refinery, back to the Inglewood fuel refinery, and then eventually be delivered to Inglewood, which wants fuel, as well as Lowell, which wants fuel, and actually most of the entire map wants fuel. I believe even Colorado Springs wants fuel. So we may end up doing some sort of, uh, you know, unique U-turny type uh, train line to get fuel over to Colorado Springs. I haven't decided on that one yet. Well, the first thing we need to do is we need to finish building out this rail line from... our uh, starting point. Now, why am I doing this crossover right here if I can even do it? I am trying to put this in because I'm realizing that I'm going to be having trains traveling in multiple directions at the same time and it would be good to be able to have them uh, there we go uh, be able to switch tracks and switch stations specifically on this side of the uh on this side of this oil well because we're going to have one train running from here to here and dropping off back to here then we'll have a second train running from here to the fuel depot and then the fuel depot we'll have to figure out how we're going to distribute the oil from there haven't figured that one out yet might be running the second line might be something else still figuring that one out um the other thing to think about is we have two more oil wells right here and since there is a two to one ratio it might make sense to go ahead and put in a truck route between these two so that this refinery is always full and therefore it will be able to transport everything down to uh, so the train here is running full both directions. So let's go ahead and continue out building our track. We are going to have a split here because I want one ranch to run over here to a uh, level. But I also need it to continue in that direction towards our fuel refinery or oil refinery I'm sorry and again not 100% sure what I'm gonna do with this I did not really leave myself a lot of room here or any room here but worst case scenario if we need to um, make this a larger route we'll add some tracks to it Actually, I take it back. That is not going to be what we're going to do. We're going to make it so that this freight train that's currently carrying just bread and food will also have some tanker cars on it. I think that's what we'll do. I think that would be the most efficient way of handling this. So, <clears throat> how do we want to set up this Lowell station, this uh, Lowell train station? Cargo terminus two will make it long, just because we know that uh, tanker cars in the future are going to be pretty big. We'll let it run parallel to this road. I think is the best way to do it. And we put two terminals in there because I am being stupid and spending more money than I need to. Oops. Oh well, wouldn't be the first time, would it, folks? No, it would not. And while I like the gentleness of that curve, I have a distinct feeling I'm not going to like it when I try to hook up there. Well, shockingly, we're still able to do some the full 75. I'm just not expecting us to be able to do anything more than that once we upgrade this to a high-speed line. Alright, 
So now we have two train lines coming in here. Where do they merge? Oh, they merge over a very long period. That's a very unnatural looking merge to me. Hmm. Now I'm having second thoughts about how I'm doing this. Let's think this one through. <clears throat> Get the crude. Take it this refinery. And this refinery back to here. From here to here. And then bring it back through the station. <clears throat> uh, that's one. That's one way to do it. I'm. I'm really stuck on the fence, folks, about whether or not I should have a second line that's gonna do pick up and drop off from here over to here. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, but I think that makes the most sense. Pick it up from here. Drop it off here. Pick up the fuel from here and drop it off here. Oh, excuse me, folks. Sorry about that. I am still getting over the cold and uh, still having a few symptoms, including this nagging cough that won't go away. I do have a much deeper and sexier voice for the meantime, though. <clears throat> All right. So I am going to run one train from here to here. And back to here and one train from here to here to here that has been decided I doubt any of these well okay a few might be capable of a double switch okay that's fine let's put in our lines we're gonna have pick up from here Inglewood West to the whole central and this will be the Inglewood crude line. And then we'll have a line from here to here to here. And this will be the Inglewood fuel line. Let's make sure our, yep, okay. And we'll need two trains, each with all tank cars. They can go 50 miles an hour. Mm, at three million a piece, we're gonna need to borrow quite a bit of money first. And that wasn't even with an engine, so. Okay, so I can borrow up to 30 million, that's my cap. Um, we're still on steam trains, but I can only do 50 anyway. Ooh, the A35 is more expensive, but it has a lot more tractive effort. I think that's what we're going to have to go with. And it's going to put us just over. Alright, so the first one is going to go to the Inglewood Cruel Line. And the second one will go to the Inglewood Fuel Line. And then let's get the game running because I need to make some of that money back. And I will need to add a cargo depot here. Oh, waited too long.
And where in low in Inglewood do we want our fuel? So kind of up front, that'll be good. That truck stop really doesn't cover it, so we will need to put in a new truck stop. And we'll put it on the side street to make our lives a little bit easier. This will be Inglewood Fuel Delivery. <clears throat> and we will need a couple of tanker vehicles for that. Mm. I want to get our folks off of the main road as quickly as possible. Curious if they'll be able to use it as an exit. Okay, so I think we are going to go ahead and do our <clears throat> go ahead and do our truck line And we 
will need a way to get vehicles to there. And there we go. <clears throat> we have our first fuel production. Anglewood has not received any yet. That's okay. We're getting there. Okay, so our food train actually right now isn't full capacity uh, because there's not enough demand. So what we'll do is we'll ditch a couple of food of box cars and we'll add on some tanker cars instead. <clears throat> and now this train can also carry fuel to Lowell. And I want to think Inglewood didn't it get its first, shouldn't it have received its first amount of fuel? <coughs> it did. Excuse me. <clears throat> okay, come on now. Thirty nine. We can have 54 waiting, it's okay. Uh, it should be on its way to Inglewood and we'll see what happens when it gets there.
Now, why would you be picking up anything there? No, you should not. Leave the fuel delivery to the fuel delivery trucks. Now, this train also didn't receive any, probably because there's not enough. Yeah, Lowell's not receiving any yet, but it will on the next run, probably. Still mostly food. <clears throat> we are making some money transferring passengers, which is great. Everybody waiting for the tram. Let's bring him back to full 72, which is perfect. <clears throat> now this freight train will be able to pick it up. Okay, so we have now expanded our fuel production and hopefully Lowell will be getting its first fuel delivery shortly. I believe that's this train. Yep. <clears throat> Let's see what happens to our city when we do that. <clears throat> Shrinking because of the emissions, which I guess the bus is pretty noisy. So 
75 and not carrying very many. <clears throat> A new tram. That may be what the doctor ordered for Lowell to uh, kind of get it to decrease the emissions and jump starts with the growth. Um, <clears throat> we probably are going to be doing a new Lowell uh, map with a tram. Let's take a quick look at what our current bus does. One, two, loops around to three, loops around to four. <clears throat> it's a pretty ugly, uh, all in all, it's a pretty ugly route. What we may do is we may just put in a east-west and turn this express bus to go from here to here. <clears throat> Let's see if there's a spot. Well, we've got our. We might move this stop to here. Or put in a third stop for both. That might be what we do. And then we have two tram lines running back and forth. <clears throat> Anyways, that will be on our next episode. We will try to fix Lowell and get it growing again. Oh, and we're doing that already. So get a little growing again in even better shape, in even faster shape, and we'll go forward from there. Thank you for commenting, liking, and subscribing. I uh, we'll hope to see you guys all in the next one.